Good morning. Thank you to all for, jo for joining us today. Also, thank you to Satish Gunasetti, his family, and the staff of Clove and Cardamom Restaurant for hosting our event today. I am Amanda Hoff, Executive Director for Visit Howard County, and will MC today's program. Joining us for remarks are Calvin Ball, Howard County Executive, Christiana Rigby, Councilwoman for District 3 and current Council Chair, Larry Tweel, CEO for Howard County Economic De Development Authority, Leonardo McClarty, President and CEO for the Howard County Chamber, and Philip Dodge, Executive Director for the Downtown Columbia Partnership. At this time, I invite Executive Ball to the podium for his remarks. Thank you. Well, happy Friday, and it's a fantastic Friday to be able to kick off for Restaurant Weeks in Howard County. This is a time not only to support our small local businesses, but to go back to your old favorites and maybe try something new. Try to expand your palate or make sure you just have something that's comforting. Enjoy some time with family and friends or have that business meeting supporting our local res restaurants. Our local restaurants not only work to ensure that we have a fantastic quality of life, but they have a wonderful scene that helps ambiance in that invest in a small local business, about 70 cents goes right back into our community. So supporting businesses like Clove and Cardamom, not only support the business, support the workers, but also support our community. So I'm glad to be here to kick off Restaurant Weeks, and I hope that not only do we support fantastic businesses like Clove and Cardamom today, these weeks, but all throughout the rest of the year. Thank you so much. Thank you, Executive Ball, for your ongoing and steadfast support of Visit Howard County and the hospitality businesses, including restaurants that we support. We will now hear from Councilwoman Rigby. Thank you. It's an honor to be here on behalf of the council, and I think County Executive Ball really did say it best. Be sure to gather with friends, families, loved ones, go to your old favorites and try something new because there's so much happening in Howard County and we really, really want you to experience all of it. I'm here on behalf of the Howard County Council and I bring this honorary resolution as well as greetings. So I'll read it now. Whereas from January 16th, 2023 through February 6th, 2023, Howard County celebrates local food, drink and community and the culinary artistry of local restaurateurs who offer specially priced multi-course meals featuring delicious food and drink. Whereas in 2008, Howard County Tourism and Promotion initiated Restaurant Weeks with the goal of giving locally owned and operated restaurants a boost during their slower seasons. And whereas Winter Restaurant Weeks and Craft Beverages has become one of Visit Howard County's signature and most successful campaigns and continues to attract diners with unique meals and menus for every taste and every budget. Now therefore be it resolved on this 13th day of January 2023 that the County Council of Howard County, Maryland thanks all of the participating restaurants for showcasing their food and drink and encourages Howard County residents to participate in winter restaurant weeks and craft beverages. Thank you. Thank you, Councilwoman Rigby, for this recognition of Restaurant Weeks. I now invite our host, Satish Gunasetti, up for his remarks. Good morning, everybody. Uh, I'm Satish Gunasetti, chef owner of Clove and Cardamom. I'm honored to have Dr. Ball here to kick off Howard County Restaurant Week today. And uh, Restaurant Week does not only uh, supports us to uh, showcase our food and craft beers and cocktails, but it also helps us grow in the community. Cloven Cardamom was established in January 2021. It's an Indian fusion restaurant, and we bring food from entire world, like Italian, Mexican, uh, Mediterranean, and of course Indian, and add our subtle spices to the food. 
And finally, I would like to thank Dr. Ball, team of Howard County Tourism, and my family uh, from Clove and Cardamom. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Gunasetti. We are along, we along with the community are looking forward to all the delicious offerings that you will be serving up during restaurant weeks. We now welcome Larry Tweel, CEO for Economic Development Authority for his remarks. Thank you. Well, first I'd like to uh, just uh, recognize your bravery. Opening a restaurant uh, in January of 2021 was a, was a bold move, uh, coming right out of the pandemic and, and recovering. The jobs in, in uh, leisure and hospitality make up almost 10% of the jobs in Howard County, almost 15,000 jobs in Howard County. And it's uh, you know up to us to support them and continue to grow that. As the county executive said, we support our small businesses. It adds to our quality of life here. And it really is an important, an important week because you know generally in the wintertime, things slow down. But next week, it's going to be warm. There's no excuses to stay in. So get out and support our, our small restaurants and businesses. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Tweel, for, for all your support and the, that you and your team provide to our small, locally owned businesses. We now welcome Leonardo McClarty, President and CEO for the Howard Chamber. Thank you again, Amanda. And again, I'm Leonardo McClarty and, and President of the Howard County Chamber. And again, it's my pleasure to be here uh, with our partner organizations to be able to help kick off Restaurant Weeks. Certainly as an organization that is uh, dedicated to small business support, we're happy to be here and one of our many small businesses in the county. And, and you know, when you think about Howard County, certainly about probably 70 some odd percent truly of our businesses in the county are classified as small businesses, small merchants. They employ less than maybe 20 employees and the like. And so when we support Restaurant Weeks, we truly are supporting those merchants that are living out a dream, that may have had a skill that was developed someplace else, but have really taken a leap of faith to open up a business and to be able to serve those in, in their community. And so uh, just lastly, I'll say when I found out we were coming here, the first thing that came to my mind was lamb chops. And so uh, <laughs> just a big plug for, uh, for again, the, the food here at Clove and Cardamon. And, and also, if you're like me, that tends to be a picky eater. Restaurant Weeks is a great time to really be able to go out and try something new. Um, there are restaurants that truly can test, can open up your palate um, regardless of your previous experiences. And so again, want to encourage our Howard County businesses, our residents, and even folks that want to come here from elsewhere to try our restaurants during the next uh, couple of weeks. And so again, thank you, Amanda, and thank you to the rest of the Howard County team, and let's support our merchants here. All that talk about food, I'm really getting hungry now. <laughs> Thank you, uh, Mr. McClarty, for the advocacy and support you, your staff, and your board provide to our small, locally owned businesses. We now welcome Philip Dodge, Executive Director for the Downtown Columbia Partnership, for his remarks. Good morning, everybody. Uh, the Downtown Partnership is thrilled for the return of Restaurant Weeks and Craft Beverages and we're thrilled to see so many of our downtown Columbia restaurants participating. Um, as Leonardo mentioned, coming from outside, as downtown Columbia and Howard County become dining destinations on their own, it's a wonderful to have another reason to try something new or visit an old favorite. And um, since we're standing in Cloven Cardamom with Satish, I'd be remiss if I didn't tell you, you need to try the Malabar Spiced Old Fashioned, you need Bollywood fries, and you need the chopped masala pizza. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Dodge, for your work on behalf of the Downtown Columbia Partnership in positioning Downtown Columbia as a top destination in the region. Thank you to all of our speakers today, and special thanks to Executive Ball and the Council for their support that allows programs like Restaurant Weeks to thrive and help our locally owned and operated restaurants. I would like to add that Restaurant Weeks has always 
been widely popular with visitors and residents. This year, we are especially sensitive to the fact that businesses and consumers are feeling inflation sting and are supporting both by purchasing six $100 gift cards from different participating restaurants and giving them away to six Lucky Restaurant Weeks enthusiasts. Visit us online at HowardCountyRestaurantWeeks.com for a full listing of participating restaurants and all the details on the gift card giveaway. Thank you for joining us today. This concludes our program.